Now, new developments today in a downtown Fargo shooting. A man has now been charged with attempted murder. This shooting took place a couple days ago. Police trying to spent hours trying to find Gregory LaCroix. This happened last Thursday. LaCroix is now charged with attempted murder and aggravated assault with a dangerous weapon. Valley News Team's Harrison Prey joins us live in studio with the latest on this case. Harrison. Justin, according to court records early Thursday morning, police responded to a shooting on the corner of 3rd Avenue and Broadway in downtown Fargo. At the scene, the victim said he was just riding his bike and asked for a cigarette before he was shot in the chest. He was taken to the hospital. Investigators say that when asking LaCroix about the shooting, he replied by saying they're all blanks and they're not real bullets. He also said he hadn't slept for two days and didn't remember everything from that night. Around 5 a.m., an officer spotted LaCroix driving a van going over 100 miles per hour on 25th Street. That van was stolen. Police eventually located LaCroix walking back in downtown Fargo where he was arrested. He was in court today where his bail was set at $750,000 cash. Court records say LaCroix remembers driving the van but denied shooting the victim. Justin. Thanks, Harrison. Fargo police say three more people are involved in this as well. A woman and two juveniles who allegedly tried to help LaCroix hide the van and get rid of the keys. They were arrested for tampering with evidence.